Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Petrocca in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link on this late Thursday evening about uh, 9.30. It's been a cool and quiet night. Skies are partly cloudy looking at the uh, Newport Pell Bridge right now. So here's the breakdown. We'll stay dry tonight right on through the daylight hours of Thursday, both morning and afternoon looking okay. It's later Friday night and later meaning around 10 o'clock. We're bringing a mix of some light rain and some light snow. That'll linger overnight into at least the first half of Saturday. This isn't anything major league by any means, just light uh, precipitation. There may be a coating of snow by daybreak on Saturday, but really nothing more than that. And, and we'll get into more detail in just a second. Storm system that actually may be more of a, of a significance is in the Monday-Tuesday time frame. I don't think this is all snow, but rather snow and rain, but some pretty strong wind as well. So we'll take one weather system at a time, but just keep in the back of your mind that uh, early next week may be getting stormy. In the meantime, a satellite photo shows a few patchy clouds streaming in right now. Here's the wider view, and you can see that moisture from the Great Lakes and across the Mississippi River Valley. And this is headed our way for Friday night. So let's take it apart hour by hour, and we'll take you through the overnight and into early on Friday morning. This is 7 a.m., starting with sunshine. Temperatures are in the middle 30s. Uh, subtle gradually fade away through increasing clouds in the afternoon. But overall, it's a nice afternoon, especially early on. Hazy sun and clouds, temperature around 48 degrees at 2 o'clock. Notice the thicker clouds by 5 o'clock in the evening. The evening commute, it looks dry. There are really no weather issues. And as we get closer to, say, 10, 11 o'clock in the evening, and you can see the precipitation working in, blue is snow, the green is rain, and the, the pink is sort of a mix. This will overspread the entire area. It, but it's really not until, I would say, well after midnight and towards dawn on Saturday where we may see some small accumulations. And, and I have to stress, this is just very minimal stuff here, which is kind of a thin, slushy coating in the areas in pink. The higher snowfall total is actually out towards western Connecticut. But for us, just a coating uh, overnight Friday night into Saturday morning. All right, here's the breakdown. Friday morning looking good. Starting with sunshine by 11 a.m. 43. The afternoon's not bad either. Dry, sun to increasing clouds. Temperatures uh, around 46 to 48 degrees. And as we head, well, let's take a look at the seven-day forecast. Um, Saturday is not a stormy day, but it's not a great day. So in other words, we're not talking like heavier amounts of rain and snow and wind, but just kind of nuisance precipitation. Breezy, raw, chilly, especially in the morning with a combination of light snow, light rain. Clearing out Saturday evening and Sunday is clearly the pick day with some sunshine. And then watching Monday and Tuesday, what I envision here is something that starts off as rain on oops, starts off as rain on Monday and then goes over to kind of a mix of rain and snow Monday night into Tuesday and very windy as well. Oh, also one reminder. Uh, it's that time of year. <laughs> Lose an hour of sleep. So before you go to bed, on late Saturday night, spring ahead, one hour. So by Sunday evening, the sunset time will be at around uh, 6.48. All right, so wrapping it up, uh, some light rain, light snow, later Friday night into the first half of Saturday. Again, Saturday, this is just nuisance precipitation. It's nothing really over the top, but it's not a great day compared to Sunday. And then a more important storm system with heavier precipitation Monday into Tuesday, along with some uh, stronger wind as well.